This is Newall's latest digital readout called the DP-1200. Uh, it's engineered specifically for long travel machine tools. The 1200 offers features that are essential to productivity of boring mills, planar mills, VTLs, milling machines, and lathes with long travels. It's built in with an extra large bright screen and it has a three and a half inch TFT screen on the upper right hand corner. The, uh, some of the features available it's two, three, or four axis including rotary and linear. The uh, real-time toolpath graphics with auto zoom. It's got an ultra-wide viewing angle. Arc contouring cal uh, calculates points along the arc for rough machining. Polar coordinate reading Line hole routines calculates points along a line at equal distance. Programmable memory teach mode, tool offsets, feed rate, linear and segmented error compensation. You can tell that we have this set up with two new all linear scales, and on the fourth axis we have a rotary drawstring encoder. You can see uh, X has a spherison scale. Y has a Microsoft scale. This particular display, we have all four axes lit up. So Z says no signal. And then W is the rotary. I want to show you what we have on W. It's a great feature for a table on one of those large machines. This is actually an encoder with a drawstring assembly. And as you can tell, the drawstring gets pulled and the display measures the travel. When you look specifically at the new DP-1200, you're going to see very clear, bright display. You can see on the x-axis, the y-axis, we can simply clear them out. There you go. And if you noticed up on the uh, TFT screen here for the feed rate on x-axis, there we go, the feed rate. And we actually have tool number one set up. The menu is quite easy to navigate through. Everything in the owner's manual is actually included here in the manual in this menu. You can see you got tool offsets, vector, PCD, which is a bolt hole, uh, bolt hole circle pattern. You got line hole pattern, arc contouring, skewing, uh, skewing uh, datums. Uh, data logging and then journal setup. Under setup, if you go to push number nine, it's going to be passcode protected. So we put in the passcode and it unlocks the setup features. You can set up access one, two, three, and four, or you can go to the general setup, language, application. We can push number two for application and you can check mill, lathe, or generic, um, plane, axis co uh, coupling, uh, probe diameter, uh, the, the setup of the beep every time you push a button it makes a beep, the L LCD brightness, and go back again. Let's say under axis number one we can set it up, we can uh, change the label, the encoder type, the display resolution, the count direction, a radius, diameter, uh, a zero approaching, or the error compensation. Go back again. Keep on going back. It does go back to the main dis display, and you notice everything comes back up on the display. Uh, here's your power button uh, referencing. If you want to half, inches, millimeters, absolute, incremental, or quick zero reset. We're really impressed with this new DP-1200. If you have a larger um, milling machine or lathe that the operator needs to see larger numbers and you want to see some tool paths for contouring and arc, arc measurements, this DP-1200 is a home run. It does accept a, a variety of signals. Uh, it's defaulted to accept, of course, the new all signal, but on the W axis we can put a uh, digital re, uh, re, readout uh, signal such as a TTL and currently we have a TTL into this. So this system is ready to go. We're going to send it out to the customer. He's going to be using all four axes, three linears and one rotary for his table 
And uh, we think it's a home run. Give us a call if you have any questions. We'd love to set up a quote for you. You can call us at area code 909-614-4521. Or go ahead and check us out on our website and you can uh, send us a quote uh, or literature request. Have a great day.